Hey guys, so I got a request. Someone wanted me to check out the new uh, like developer preview here of the Mac OS operating system. And that is, this is basically uh, that thing. So uh, you can see here, brand new interface. It's called Joe Smith as this like uh, mountain in the US. Uh, so let's go into about this Mac. You can see it's a Mac OS 10.10. .10. And they, yeah, they're calling it Mac OS X 10.10 right now, but X stands for 10, I think. So it's a little bit random there. Uh, but it's on my on my four gigabytes here, Intel Core i7 processor, Mac, uh, Nvidia GeForce, and uh, some other interesting things. You can see here how the menu is a little bit different. Display, a 15 inch, 1680 times 1050 display. You can see here kind of like the flat UI uh, in the menus. Uh, which I find uh, very very attractive. Uh, so I haven't got the things up and running right now. Uh, the things that that, are, that is new, but you can kind of see here. I might do a, if I see a lot of people interested in this, then I definitely might do more videos on this. But you can see Safari here has new icons and a ton of other things. You can see Game Center uh, and Android file transfer here. I mean that's just an app. Uh, you can kind of see here on the side, kind of reminds about iOS 8 beta 1 uh, here with the today and notifications area. Pretty nice. See if we'll be able to add more widgets here. We have some information here. Sweet. Let's just close this one down. To see here if we can bring up system preferences and see how that one looks. You can see here. To see if we can go into the um, let's fire up some apps here and, and try them out uh, first of all you can see here how it looks in terms of menus how the tab view and everything looks opening new tab yeah I think this is a new thing that you'll be able to have tabs maybe not maybe it was all really well but I mean I'm not a pro uh, iCloud here airdrop that will be more focused uh, that you'll be able to send more devices uh, or send more things to your Mac from your other iOS devices. Uh, applications here, you can see all my apps, which I, don't, I mostly just have the basic apps here. I kind of like this menu when uh, you have the menu like this. You can see my clean desktop, don't have any documents, downloads. Interesting. Uh, you can see, of course, these tags that I think all run as a wobble. Uh, has a pretty new cool search window here uh, that goes in the middle of the screen. Let's see here, is it a little bit slow? Yeah, there we go. So you can see here in the middle. So if you search for something, I can already see the. So now it brings up just the calculator there. It's just trying to find the best things. And there's a lot of apps that hasn't been updated, like uh, this this little thing. Uh, this calculator doesn't seem to be updated to the latest UI. Uh, but you can also, of course, search for documents. If I just search for downloads here, should bring up, yeah, bring out a folder here. Uh, download uh, the PDF document. You can immediately preview it, which I gotta say is pretty cool. And uh, maybe you can tap here to immediately go in here. No. If you just tap on it, you will be. Okay. So I'm just going to close that down. Oh, interesting. I'm a little bit annoyed that they don't have kind of like this uh, Windows 7 thing that you'll be able to have two windows side by side in an easy way. At least I don't think that they have that. Uh, let's just uh, check out some other things here. You can see Wi-Fi menu and everything kind of looks the same. Uh, you can see my kind of accounts here. And I already checked this one out. Let's just uh, bring up Safari here. You can kind of see how Safari has changed a lot in terms of how it looks in the menus and everything. You can see here kind of like the loading bar and all that it looks pretty fresh. Just 
to bring up Apple's page here you can see everything and of course on Apple's page you can see all the um, all news here about iOS and of course about uh, Mac OS 10 as well see here if we can go back to Apple's page and see yeah there we go Mac OS 10 Joe Smith you can see a little bit more in detail it's gonna come in fall for everyone um, uh, of course Safari so updates mail updates iCloud drive messages and you'll be able to like take calls and stuff like that uh, from um, from your if, if you get a call from your on your phone you'll be able to reply on your computer and the handoff features, instant hotspot. Just uh, go into design here. You can kind of see that uh, most apps has been has been updated to the brand new UI. You can kind of see those cool buttons now in the corner, how they have changed cleaner uh, look here down at the icons. I still like that they have icons down at the bottom because I think that's one uh, more uh, one important thing. And I also think that uh, kind of a lot of things that you have open up uh, changes the background changes if depending on the kind of like the background that you're using. You can see maps and uh, I'm not sure what that is, like mail or something. Messages, reminder, iCloud, very, very good if you have a lot of other products. Notification center, where you'll be able to see in a better viewing uh, than what you did in the, the current uh, version here of uh, iOS, which is Maverix. And you can see here if we use the pick up some other apps, maybe like messages here, and we'll see if we can pop it off. Take some time here, there we go, messages. Sign in here. And um, maybe I can just try to send a message here to my. Yeah, I probably might do another video about that uh, when I check it out a little bit, probably. Uh, you have, of course, the calendar here, which looks pretty, pretty nice here, upgraded. I mean, I use a Mac every day, so I kind of see when they have done some differences here, but it looks more clean. As you see reminders here, that's not actually an app that I use that much, but also has a little bit of an updated interface. You of course have mail if you use that, notes, which also has a new interface of course. Uh, I'm not sure, if, I don't think iTunes have uh, been updating. Just fire that up a little bit quick. Don't download. I don't want to download right now. Uh, what else do we have? To, I mean, should have like multitasking here. You can see that kind of view. And uh, I might uh, see here iBooks, the App Store, of course. Some useful stuff. I don't know why they don't show. Oh, there we go. Show percentage. I think percentage is kind of like a must have. If you can't see the percentage, that's a little bit annoying. <laughs> uh, so yeah, just a quick little look here. I mean, uh, I just wanted to do a video. And then this is not a video just covering specific new features, but uh, uh, I might do a video like that also if people are interested. So yeah, quick look, peace out.